You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures to you. So my mother approaches me with seven different pictures of seven different girls. And she says to me that I have to pick one as my wife. Else, I won't be crowned the prince of this kingdom. Okay, so she says this is Frida. Yeah, Frida is a pilot. Yeah, she said Frida is a pilot. Okay, so. Uh, she looks really good. Oh, she looks good. And she's a pilot. Okay, I'll just um, check her out and see what she has to offer. Oh. So my mother says this is Dr. Christie. Ooh, Dr. Christie. She really looks beautiful. So Dr. Christie. My mother says she's a medical doctor and uh, she studied at Oxford University. Hmm. She looks really brilliant. Beautiful. Elegant. Smart. She has a good fashion sense. So I like the little girl, Oma, yeah, I like her, she looks very innocent, she appears really, really innocent, mm. but surprisingly my mother says she is very educated and I can see that she graduated from one of those northern universities. Mm. But why is she working in Paris? She must have been employed out of pity. Okay, so... Cassandra. Mm. She doesn't look bad at all. I think I should pay more attention to her. Keeping the meal. Hey, you come closer. I saw some behind your highness. Now, what are you doing with my son? Nothing, your highness. What in God's name are you doing with the prince? I am doing nothing with the prince, your now highness. I'm going to ask you this for the very last time. So, do not give me that crap again. What in the world are you doing with my son? I am doing nothing with the prince, your highness. You have nothing to do with my son, yet he's asking silly questions about you. 
Your Highness, what kind of question is he asking? Can you swear that you have nothing to do with the prince of this kingdom? I swear by my late father's grave, I have nothing to do with the prince. Now you better listen. I have arranged seven beautiful class maidens from this kingdom for my son to pick one from them. You are nowhere close. Therefore, whatever feelings you nothing in your heart for my son should be bothered. Have I made myself clear? Yes, Your Highness. Now once the food is ready, you serve it and call us. Good afternoon, dear. How are you? All right, I called to find out if you're available. Um, not a problem. Just that my son returned, and uh, I would like you to come, you know, meet with him so both of you can get to know each other better. Oh, you'll be coming tomorrow. It's all right, no problems. I'll be waiting. Bye, Cassandra. Cassandra is not available. Hmm. Why don't I try Erika? Yeah, Erika. Hello, Erika. How are you? Tell me, how is work? So why didn't you return as promised? You just prepared your sumptuous meal for my son. He loved it. You can't believe it. He's asking after you already. He's in love. Are you for real? You're on your way to the palace. All right, my darling, I'm waiting for you. I can't wait to see you. My son will be happy. <laughs> All right, bye. This is so unfair. My mother went too far, surprising me with seven different women in seven different pictures. This is going to get me to trouble. I mean, if she had shown me like three or let's say four, it would have been so easy for me to pick one. But right now, I am totally confused. Come in. Hello. Who are you, please? <laughs> Did the Highness not tell you about my visit? Um, you're, you're Cassandra, right? The nurse midwife. Cassandra? Yes, Cassandra. <laughs> well, I am Erica. Oh, Erica, Erica. Well, Oh, Erica, the TV presenter. Oh, nice. Please have a seat. Have a seat. Thank you. Sit down. Mm. So, how are you? I'm fine. Oh, good. Mm. I was told you enjoyed my Oha soup. Oh, yes. I... I had a taste of it. It, it tasted really nice. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And I hope you are... As sweet as your ohasu. Uh -huh. I'm sweeter. Really? You're sweeter. Yeah. You're cute. 
Thank you for your kind words. And you're, you're gorgeous. Thank you. So, I was told you are a TV presenter. Yes, I am. That's good for you. <laughs> so, would you like to show me how you present? Sure. So, are you ready to present? To sure. How many TV stations have you presented? So many. So many. Oh man! Oh man! Oh man! Yes, Your Majesty. What's going on? Where is my wife? My son? They are in the room. Your please remind my wife that I've been waiting at the dining. And please fetch my son too. Yes, Your Majesty. Hey, what's wrong with you? Don't you know how to knock? My prince, I knocked. What do you mean you knocked? I didn't hear you knock. Besides, I didn't say come in. I'm sorry, my prince. The king sent me to call you. Lunch is served. Now get out. Said you should leave. Can you imagine? Your Majesty. The Queen will soon be here. But what about my son? Your Majesty, the Prince is with a visitor. Guest. Well, well I've, I've dish out my food. Can't keep continue waiting. Um, I don't need the water, I just need the uh, You will not believe what I'm about to tell you. What? Our son Prince and Erica slept together. Ew. Even as we speak, they are still in the room, in the bed, doing what I do not know. Jotem, why are you disturbed by the turn out of events? What were you thinking when you brought seven pictures of maidens for him? He's just simply flourishing with them, that's all. Flourishing with them? What On their the, noses? What's this fuse all about? My goodness, I can't believe this. I'm highly disappointed. Erica, that I thought was a decent maiden of this land. I never knew that she would see a man at first sight. Then she would open her legs and sleep with a man. It's a shame. Come on, sweetheart. Don't allow these youngsters, you know, prick your blood pressure. 
please. Think of this. Why would my son do this disgusting thing before his subject? It's shameful. Very shameful. Erica. You slept in this palace. I thought you left that yesterday. No, Your Highness. I slept here. So you are this desperate. I... I don't get Your Highness. How could you open your legs so wide for the prince? How? Your Highness, the prince and I will soon be getting married. There is nothing wrong sleeping with my soon-to-be husband. You call it soon-to-be? Not yet, your husband. For your information, I've got seven of you for him to pick one from. What? Of course you heard me. So you opening your legs for him immediately doesn't make you the chosen one. I expect you to be wiser. Your Highness, that wasn't the original plan. It's not adding up. You never told me there are six other girls in the picture. Well, you heard me now. But you recommended me for the prince. Exactly the same way I recommended the other sis. This wasn't what you told my parents. Well, you better deal with it. Ah! Excuse me. I have a guest now. I, I guess it's one of the selected maidens for the prince. Hmm. Your guest is as good as mine. Cassandra, sweetheart! Come, my darling. Look at this girl. You look good as always. Thank you, darling, and you too. Thank you. How are you? <laughs> Very well, sweetheart. All right, let me take you inside so you can see the crown prince, your future husband. Thank you. Come on, let's Here? go. Um, you know what? Let me see if I can help you get some no, things. No, don't Let worry. me help you give us some things. Don't worry. Babe. Babe. I've been calling your phone since yesterday. You weren't picking up. What's happening? Because I do not want to pick. Something in me is telling me that you're still mad at me. Is it over what happened the other day? How best can I make you understand that you're the only human on this earth that I do I, not I, want to lose? Oscar, please. It's still very early in the morning and I can guess you're going to work. Please just leave. Why can't you see that I can't live this life without you, babe? I mean, losing you is like losing the air that I breathe. Can't you see that yourself? Listen, I'm sorry about whatever. Please, just give me some time to fix some things up. <laughs> the air that you breathe. Really. Um, can I see you during lunch time? There is something he doesn't want me to know about. I am very certain. But something is hiding. Come 
Majesty. What happened? Your Majesty, honestly, this girl's a bunch of disappointments. What is it? They're already making out. What? Is Prince Madabuchi stupid? Must he sleep with everything in skirt? I am highly disappointed. I can't believe our only son, the crown prince of this kingdom, has become a Casanova. Blame you in all of this. How? What did I do? I mean, I never saw it coming. Our only son is practically in a body count and mission with all the smeddens. You will not bring another woman for him. Well, I guess it's late. How do you mean? Of course. Even if we decide not to bring Medans again for him, he's got their contacts. He will still call them. I can't believe Cassandra is also cheap. I'm shocked. Of course, you know of a saw Mother Butchie is a ladies' man. I think we need to come in now. How do you mean? Of course. We need to get him a good maiden for him to marry. Oh, that will and not work. And end all this madness. It will not work, my love. How do you mean? He's old enough to know what is best for himself. Your Majesty, you talk as if I care. I mean, I don't even need his consent before doing it. Oh, there you go again. You need to stop greeting me, you know that. What have I done? You don't know what you have done? No, my prince. I want a glass of orange juice. I'll be in my room. Make it quick. Mama, Mama, I need to go to the mall. I need to get stuffs for my two electrics. Mama, I'm talking to you. Anyways, I'll see you later. Your father and I have decided that you will not leave this house until we have unraveled the problem with you. So you're not going anywhere. Hey, Mama say I don't understand this thing. I don't understand what you're saying. Oh, but you don't let me go out now. I need to go and get stuff for my toiletries now. What's this? Zina, what's the problem with you? Do you want to kill yourself? Don't you know you are all we have got? What will this shame stop? In short, your father warned me to make sure you don't leave this house. So you're not going anywhere. Mama, what are you saying now? Hey, why are you locking me inside as if I'm a child? I'm not a child now. I need to go out and get stuff. Open the door. I said and I repeat myself, you are not going anywhere. This shame is enough. It's enough. Mama, you are locking me in my own father's house. In my own father's house, you're locking me. It's not fair. It's not nice. Is it, Mama, is Do you know what they now call your mother? Look at her. The mother of the pretty thief. The beautiful thief. That's not what I envisaged for you in life. You're not a thief and this must stop. Sit down. I know you're going to that mall to steal. Nothing else. So, Mama, this is house arrest, Abby. No, this is what we call it. It's house arrest. It's house arrest that you're locking me. What kind of thing is this one now? Hi. Mama, this is not nice, bro. This is not nice. It's not nice. I'm a 
brings you here? Uh, Divya, we are here because of my daughter. I want to find out what is wrong with her. Just hold on. Let me discuss with them that are with me here. Then I will come back to you. Hmm. They have come to make inquiry on what is wrong with their daughter. Alright. Okay. Money for consultation. Hey, go on, Five thousand. <laughs> 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 oh, clip <laughs> do what is it? That is the problem. Let me know. So that I can tell them. If they fought me, I will fought you. Mm hmm You are man. Where are you? Is that all? That will not go. Okay. Ichi, you are saying that what is happening to your daughter is not man made, neither is it spiritual. Mm -hmm. Then what is it? On a jelly, guinea cobble. What is it? Just tell me. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not going to go high now. What he's saying is that he has nothing more to say. Hey, we be an uncle, be a zioku, be a kuge zioku. We don't collect money for people and tell them lies, and we don't talk what is not true. Yeah. No. Yes, because all the other places we've been to, mm -hmm. they said she is suffering from water spirits. Mm -hmm. Yes. That is all that places. Not to be a joke. This is to be a joke. Ichie, do you have any other question? No. What? What? It's neither man nor spiritual. In what? It's not the one that I have said something different from all the other places you have visited. I'll tell you I'm not going to see. I'm 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 going to
I reject it for her. Still, we cannot be her father. She's not a little bit of I'm good with it. And that's why you tend to get habits. No. Still, we cannot be her daughter. My daughter here is enslaved. Forces right here. Jesus, trying to destroy that. That's all I see. Reject it, Mama. I reject it. I will not be enslaved and I will not die. You will not die. You will not die. I can show you. My husband. What is what do you do from here? What next? Nothing except. My life has gone upside down. So what's up? Why haven't you started working at the family company? Uh, I've been very busy. Busy with what? Are there other businesses that you've ventured into that I'm not aware of? Yeah, I've just been busy with other stuff. I've just been very busy, yeah. Okay. Um, Oscar. Yeah. I wanted to tell you something. So my mother showed me seven girls in a picture. And she wants me to pick a wife what seven girls yeah sounds weird right <laughs> indeed ridiculous bro i know <laughs> but i'm very disappointed why they all lose they all lose no self-respect no dignity they see me and they go pants down wait 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 why but I, I, I had my way. I, we had a thing. Ah, yeah. I knew it. So why don't you just come out straight and tell me that you've been sleeping and dumping the women instead of trying to beat around the bush? Oscar, I never said I dumped anyone. Because I know you very well. That's you your language, it. bro. That's your language, all right? We had we had a thing and that's it. But I, I was just disappointed because I, I didn't expect them to, you know, give in that, you know, that quick. So while they gave in, you were busy using and dumping them. Anyway, um, I know you very well. Oh, it's okay. Let me just quickly pee. Excuse me. Ah, oh, I'm so pressed. Yeah, you know the rest of mine. Yeah, let me use all the, the way one. down yeah, to your right. Yeah, okay. Let me use that one. Good. Oh, don't forget you have seven women at your disposal. Give me a break, Oscar. I know you very well. I know you. You're my man. I'll always tell you the truth, here and there. Okay, sorry. Oh, my prince, my prince. My one and only prince. Ness, king of the kingdom. You've been sleeping and dunking them. Can you give me a break, bro? <laughs> That's impossible, bro. I need to tell you the truth. Ah, goodness. That reminds me, Oscar. What about Eve? How's she? Man, it's quite unfortunate, man. What's up with her? My, my mom doesn't want me to marry Eve. Why is that? She doesn't want me to marry from her place. Do you know that my mom went as far as threatening to take her life should I marry Eve? What? It's that serious. Oscar, did your mom suddenly forget everything Eve did for her? This is really sad. 
But my mom is obsolete. My mom doesn't seem to be moved at all. I have pleaded with my mother. I have begged my mother. I have actually done everything a child should do to get their mom to concede into something. All prove abortive. Oscar, I'm aware Eve is a very good girl. Very good girl. She was well raised. Yeah. Well behaved. Your mother should have a rethink. I don't know. I don't know what she wants. Your mother should have a rethink. Hi, Eve. Hello. Prince Maduabuchi speaking. Oh, my prince. How are you? I'm doing great. How are you? Um, I had wanted to call you. Oh, nice. That's nice of you. That means our minds work together. <laughs> I know, right? Um, I wanted to speak to you about something. Can you come over to the palace? Uh, you know I'm very busy, like I'm a very busy person, I don't know, I'm not sure. You're busy? Okay. Alright, I'll just, I'll just make it brief, okay? Listen, I... I'm not comfortable with what's happening between... Yourself and... Oscar. I feel like things should get better. I don't know, my friends. I don't know. I mean, I've been with Oscar for you know how many years. I've been with him through thick and thin. I've been there in his darkest days. I don't know what he wants from me again. Yeah, I know that. And he's not talking about marriage. Listen, this is not my concern, actually. But then... I feel like you guys are my friends and I should get involved because I like you as a person and I want the best for you. Did he tell you anything about his mother? No. What about her? Okay, I... I'm not in the right position to tell you anything concerning that. I want you to confront him and ask him questions. He needs to tell you what his mother thinks about you. My prince, is there something you know that you're not telling me? Listen, Eve, I know both of you love each other. And I'm aware you love him more. I want you to give him a second chance. And if he doesn't sit up and does the need for I want you to make other decisions. Okay. I'll talk to you later. Thank you. I'm a With love and strength for each new day, he will make a way for me. He will make a way. May God be made. You will come 
and victorious. You will win. Hmm? Hey. This will come to pass. I'm not taking this call. Never. Oscar has a whole lot of explanation to do. He has to tell me what his mother is doing to me that I do not know. He has a whole lot of explanation to do. Stop calling my phone. You are at the shop. I've been calling your phone. You are not taking calls. What's going on? Please, I'm not caught out for all this, okay? I have work to get What has come over you? You and your mother has come over me. I don't get you. So, after Thing I did for you and your mother. This is how you choose to pay me back, huh? Your mother now thinks I am not good enough for you. Prince said this to you? Oh God. Prince, 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 why now? Prince, why? Oh God. Okay, um, here's the thing. It's not my making. As a matter of fact, my mother wanted me to marry someone else. She wants me to marry from my place. So why did you not tell me before now? Because I didn't want to. I don't even know what to say, but I don't want to break your heart. I am already heartbroken. I, 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 feel, I feel betrayed. I feel used. I'm sorry, please. Come on, I'm so okay. sorry. You're sorry? Sorry. What are you sorry for? I, I don't even know. The thing is, my mother is even threatening to take her life if I if I if I marry you. <laughs> wow! And you know I can't afford to lose her. Wow! Really? Really? Your mother wants to die. Your ungrateful mother wants to die. So she prefers you marry from your place. Is this okay? That's fine. If there's, no, it's okay. If there's something you don't know about this whole thing. You see, my mother is all I've got. We lost our father when we were still little. It's been our mother all the years. She single-handedly raised I and my siblings. How best can I explain this whole thing to you that I can't afford to lose that woman? She's all I've got. I, I don't want my mother to die all in the name that I caused it. I'm sorry. Get out. What? If. If. Did you just ask me to leave your shop? You heard me. Leave. You just, just give me some time and let's. Get out! 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 Marry your mother. It's my daughter. That's Zina's voice. Wait, she, she's calling me for help. Zina, Zina, where is it? Zina? Where is my daughter? Where is she calling me from? Zina! 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 Somebody help me, please! 
Somebody help me! Help. Hey, sir, please! Sir, please, please! Don't come and help me, please! Wow! Please. Finally, you have been trapped. Hey! No! Sir, please, I beg you, come and don't tell me! My hands are dying, please come and help me! Please, I beg you, I beg you, please, just come and come and come and untie me, please, I beg you. I not. You deserve to die here so that people of this town will rest for you. Hey, no, 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 please, I swear, I'm innocent. I'm innocent of everything, please, come and untie me, I beg you. I cannot. I cannot. You deserve to die here. Please, please, I beg you. Sir, please, don't go. Don't go, don't go, please, I beg you. Don't go, hey. hey. Somebody help me! Somebody help me! Mama! 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 Mama, please! Please come! Come on! Somebody help me! Help me! Help me! Help me! Mama, where are you? Mama, where are you? Hey, Mama! Mama, please! Mama, please, please don't tie me! Don't tie me! Hey! Who tied you up? Who have sworn that my daughter will end up like this? What is it? What is it? Mama, please! Don't tie me! Don't tie me! Don't tie me! Oh, Mama! Mama, don't tie me, please! Z Z Zina! Zina! Patricia! 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 Wake up! Oh. Hi. Oh my god, it's a dream. A dream? Hi. What happened? Zina! What about her? I saw her daughter tied up under a tree and she was virtually reaching out to me and begging me to come and untie her. The more I tried, the tighter I tried. I tried but I could not. She kept on crying and beckoning and saying, Mommy, Mommy. Oh, oh, my husband, her daughter is in trouble. She needs help. We have done virtually everything we can. What else are we going to do? Oh, God, please. All I ask for is for her to be like her mates. Okay. Let her be like her Stop mates. Stop stressing yourself out. I don't want to lose it's your okay. little child. It's okay. She's only no, good. Sit up. Let's go to the bedroom. Sit up. Sit up. Sit up. Hi. Sit up. Sit up. Sit now. Sit It's okay. It's okay. Stop calling me. I'm trying to make a call. What? He's busy my call? <laughs> no. Hey, listen. My business with you is over. Don't call me again. Shh. Like, seriously? I think I have to go to the palace. I have to go there right now to know why he's busy in my call. Because I, I, I don't understand. After enjoying the woman in me, he think he can use me and dump me. No. I have to go there right away. Hi. Um, this is Freda. Hello. Am I speaking with uh, Frida? It's nice to have you here. Are you really going to end the call on the prince? Yes, my name is Prince Madabuchi.
Yes, I was told. I was told you're a pilot and you you fly everywhere. That's good news. So how do I see you? When are you coming over this side? Oh, that's sad. In that case, I'll come over to see you then. The more reason I should see you. Listen, Lagos is just 45 minutes from here, alright? I can jump on the next available flight and uh, I'll see you. How about that? Alright then, see you later. Erica, what's the fuss about? Why are you so mad? Why are you so angry? You tried to call me. I ended the call because I was trying to make another call. You tried to call again. I ended your call. I mean, that should tell you that I'm busy. If you're sensible. What busy with what is that mean? Busy sampling the seven maidens your mother got for you. Is that it? I beg your pardon. Where's that coming from? What do you mean by that? If you think you can use and dump me, then you have another thing coming. So I'm trying to understand where you're coming from. So what's... What do you mean, use and dump you? Is that the situation here? I don't think so. Alright, let me paint a clearer picture so you can understand. You met a good-looking guy. You obviously fell in love with him. You threw yourself at him. You had sex with him. And um, that's our story. Nobody's bullying anyone like you claim. It's very simple. You're not the one for me. You cannot be the one for me. So you need to stop stalking me. Like seriously? Yeah. I am stalking you. You are stalking me. Listen to me. You cannot be my wife. If I see my wife, I'll definitely know her. A cheap, loose, dirty girl like you cannot be my wife. I'm sorry. How about Cassandra? You slept with her also, right? Cassandra? Um, yes, we had sex, but... You're all the same. Loose and dirty. She can't be my wife. All of you are the same. Yeah. I promise you, you're going to regret this. Regret what exactly? Wait, you don't understand, right? I'll paint a better picture for you to understand. Did I force you? No. Did I rape you? No. Did we have sex? Yes. Mm -hmm. Did you enjoy it? Oh, yes. Did we have consensual sex? Of course, yes. Are we adults? Hell yeah. So what are you talking about? Your mother carefully got girls for her Casanova son to be sleeping with. Oh. But I'm going to promise you one thing. The royal family will not get away with this. Excuse me. Well, everyone is entitled to their opinions, but did I force you? No. Did I rape you? No. Did we have sex? Yes, we did. Are we adults? Of course we are. Did you enjoy it? Hell yeah, you did. And um, did I enjoy it? Mm. I'm not flattering you. You are actually the most beautiful girl I have seen in a while.
the most beautiful girl with the ugliest character you mean? That's not true. It's not your fault. No one has the right to judge you. Okay? I don't know, I, I just feel as though my hands are crossed. No. You're totally wrong, Zina. You're not cursed. Speaking about your situation, I had... I had a conversation with the doctor. We spoke extensively about you. Yes. Okay, which is... The doctor confirmed you are...